All right, guys, welcome back to Full Circle with Joyce. Thank you again for your company. And uh, remember, you can engage with me on social media and on our SMS line, double two triple nine. And uh, shout out here, someone says, um, Chasamani tuned in from Mombasa. Thanks for the topic. We should leave everything to God. I'm really going through a hard time right now, but assured that God is going to do something. Absolutely. Keep that faith and keep choosing joy. And um, Becky from Kisarian says, um, Hey, Joyce, I'm loving the show and you look smart. March, big up yourself. Um, it's Becky Salimia Camera Ladies Wako. Wow. Okay. Up here today, actually, I have Maureen. I love to call her Abuju Buju. <laughs> And my director for the day is Lynette Wanafanya Kazipoa. Shout out to the entire ladies crew. Do I have any other ladies downstairs? I have Rose, Anne, and Carol, of course. Asante sana to all of you guys. I do appreciate you. Wanaume mpate mtu wa watumia SMS pekenu. Mkai for now. <laughs> anyway, with that said, I want us to switch gears and get to our next topic. I'm so excited to meet this girl. She's beautiful and she does really beautiful work as well. Her name is Chris from All Things Chris. Karibu sana to Full Thank Circle. You. How are you? Oh, I'm so excited to be here. How it's great to have you here. Tunakuona tu hapo kwa mtandao, kienda sijima nyumba za watu and doing all sorts of makeovers and right. things. Um, but it's great to have you here on the show. It's great to be here. It's a full circle moment for me as well. Oh, yeah? To meet you. Oh, thank yeah, you. That's yeah, very sweet. Thank you so much. <laughs> thank you. Um, now, before we get into some of the design tips that you want to share with mm. us, I want to learn a bit more about you and your journey into yeah. interior design. Where did all of this begin for you? Oh, man, that's crazy. Is it? Because uh, when I think about it, I didn't actually major in interior design. I did urban planning. I did, um, and then my major was Canadian public administration and governance. However, I did it as, an, as, a, as a minor. Okay. And, but I've always been passionate all right. about... Um, about home decor, about okay. interior design. So it's just <laughs> where life has landed me now, I guess. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. Well, um, um, in a moment here, uh, Chris is going to be sharing with us some five tips, okay, um, as far as what we can do to really upgrade our spaces. And so let me just also remind you guys that you can reach me on our SMS line, double two, triple nine, and also on Facebook at Switch TV Kenya. Let me just uh, check out what's happening over there very quickly and throw out a couple shout outs okay here we go oopsie there we are all right so uh mali safi nation says inspired and tuned in from homa bay asante sana i also have dan mukurino wakiandu who says thika tuned in as usual god always stands with us no matter what we go through absolute truth to that esther munyoike uh, tuned in from camp kiambu uh, thank you as well i also have marianne mwikali who's tuned in and says the show is lit asante sana and she's watching from Loi Tok Tok. Um, I have Susie Ndegwa wa Kikuyu um, watching from Kikuyu then. Asante sana. Nelson Getago Anyona, uh, you're watching from County 001. Thank you very much for that. I have Owen uh, Gray um, locked in from Outer Marish. Sestina Mutindi um, from Machakos. John Gashoka Fundisimu <laughs> from Ngano Nyandara County. Princess K.E. Mukorogo. John Wa Element Taita as well and Chui uh Choi Weila. Okay, from Nyeri. Now let's do this. I want us to take a clip uh and watch uh, a bit of Chris's work actually. So take a look at this. Welcome back to my channel. My name is Chris. If it's your first time here, Karibu Sana. Always great to have you back. Uh, if you are an oldie, but a goodie. <laughs> so hit the like button, sis, and let's go. So on today's video, I wanted to talk about some of the trends, the deco design trends that we have or we are seeing for 2020. What's exciting? Um, I am finding that one of the trends that's really, really, really popping right now is marble. Marble countertops, marble walls, marble floors, marble 
phone cases marble is everywhere and it looks amazing i can't even wait to do my kitchen countertops with marble and some of the places that you can find um, marble contact paper if you can't afford actual marble uh, include ushanga store which is one of the instagram um, stores that i follow and i find they have some really cutesy stuff you're gonna see marble um in very high-end um homes as well all right so that was actually a clip of chris on her youtube channel all <laughs> things chris yeah and uh, how has that journey been for you it seems like it's opened up a lot of different doors for you as well i don't know if you had yeah. intended to be doing all these you know celebrity home makeovers but did it kind of just spring up from you kind of taking that leap into youtube yeah mm -hmm. um it's just really been exciting so i can't even believe that every day i, I think I'm, I'm, I'm wowed that this is actually my life. Yeah. So um, I have a 19 month old mm -hmm. and being at home as a stay at home mom, sometimes you're just like, what do I do? And I just started giving people business idea tips okay. um, on how they, so I, was, I was doing a lot of business tips, okay. um, some of the business ideas that are there online, but everybody kept asking, what about that shelf behind you? Oh, oh I wanna see about that cushion and okay. that sort of thing. So I think it's sort of just um, transitioned into people noticing that people are more interested and more keen Fantastic. on the decor. Yeah. And then now, you know, um, well, look I at guess you. people noticed. Yeah, look at you. <laughs> and it's, it's amazing how yeah. sometimes the thing that really unlocks stuff for you is right under your nose isn't it it's or in your case it was right mm -hmm. behind you yes <laughs> with <laughs> my your shelves. shelves so you know wherever you are yeah. at home, you know you do, sometimes you don't have to look too far no yeah not at you all. can and you know pray for god to help you develop those ideas that are literally sitting right under your nose exactly but speaking then of these ideas we want to get some tips from you mm -hmm. as far as um some of the interior design trends um that are really making the waves for 2020 in, in 2020 yeah now marble has been there for quite a while but it seems to be one of those classic timeless things that's yes. probably going to be there for a long time yeah and mm -hmm. then the thing is that um people are almost always so scared that it's such an expensive um upgrade mm -hmm. um but there's options with things like contact paper which mm -hmm. i mentioned on the clip there that mm -hmm. you can find at um instagram pages such as ushanga store okay. and they just really nicely glam up your kitchen countertops you you can use them in your bathroom yeah and um, guys have you, yeah. get, you guys have some images on your screens you can be yes. enjoying and uh, following along the conversation as you look at those yeah but certainly there are these cost-effective options Absolutely. with the ones for contact paper though are they as durable i mean what happens if water sort of kind of seeps in between and stuff like that yeah so there are some options that are waterproof um, however, um, I always say like if you're going to do it on, um, maybe you don't want to, I mean, even if, it, if it, even if you have to maintain and change it up after a while, um, knowing that you spent about 2,000 shillings on a roll of contact paper for five right. meters, it's not rather than to break you know, the bank something thousand for the actual <laughs> for the actual marble however yeah. if you can get the actual marble Good i absolutely you. love porcelain marble floors um i have that at my office mm -hmm. um and um it looks absolutely beautiful it's okay. nice when you have contrasting walls like yeah. if you have darker walls okay to do that um, all right they shine and they're bright great yeah okay well let's move on to our second tip and remember guys you can send in your feedback and your questions to double two triple nine um but there's velvet velvet and it's been happening not only like for home and yes. deco, but even in our clothes. But yes. talk to us about velvet. It's it's. I think growing up, we never really thought much of velvet. You no, know we I mean? didn't. And I'm not a big fan of velvet on my clothes, mm -hmm. um, but it depends on what piece of item it actually is. But um, velvet on furniture, velvet on curtains, mm -hmm. it's really lax. Yes. Mm -hmm. um, so you would find it in very high-end stores. Um, and um, but what I love so much about velvet which I share on that video is that it's very easy to clean so if you're having your messes with the kids on the dining chairs it's an easy clean you just take okay. your super bright and you can just easily just wipe away um, all the food messes so Fantastic. velvet is also really nice for durability and longevity how it's very it, for longevity mm -hmm. you know okay um so let's take a look then at the next one which is florals yes oh <laughs> you sort of perked up in talking about yeah florals. i mean who doesn't love flowers i uh -huh. mean i'm sure some people don't however i'm um, it's 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 
I love adding it on fabric, like even on throw pillows, because um, it really just adds to that pop. Um, one of the other tips I share as well, which I think we're going to talk about next, is that neutral colors really allow you to be versatile with your deco style. Mm. And with having a floral print as a throw pillow, it just adds to that pop so the yeah. seat isn't so boring because it's neutral. Yeah. You know? So but how do you deal with mm -hmm. florals and maybe you live with a guy? Yes. <laughs> they don't want no flowers. Yes, yes, yes. <laughs> on their couches. Yeah. How do you sort of create this balance in your home, you know, for his and hers? Yeah. I mean, for me, one of the tips I love to give is just having that one pop, one one item on the couch that could pop. Okay. So you could have the other throw pillows be very grazed and muted down, you know, just yeah. so that earthy tones so that it's not too plush but that's floral right there yeah and yeah. even if it was a guy's home it would still look good right yeah, yeah. and we're basically just talking about print generally but florals really are in and trendy in 2020. <laughs> okay okay yeah. great um well speaking of print i know you have there with us with you a stencil yeah. and uh, you're going to be telling us a little bit more about that but i want us to take a break yes. and then we'll come back and continue with this discussion but very quickly here someone just says wow she's beautiful I know. <laughs> uh, and then someone says, hey, it's Faith from Uchawala, loving the inspiration. Keep it locked right here, guys. And we're going to be back um, at the top of the hour with even more Full Circle with Joyce. Mm -hmm.